What is up YouTube, Lucas here from Ecomails. And in this video, I wanted to cover a tutorial about the JudgeMe app within Shopify and how to integrate it with Klaviyo so you can use your product reviews within your abundant flows, but you can also send the review request within Klaviyo and you can also send the reply after someone submitted a review through Klaviyo. So first things first, why do you actually want to do this? So as you can see, this is kind of the ugliest design that you ever saw probably um, and this is what the judge me app uses um, as the standard and i think that's definitely not something you want to give your client uh, like your, your customers in terms of customer experience and also um i think working on your design will definitely increase your click-through rate and inevitable your um customer review rate so how many customer reviews do you get on a monthly basis you can definitely increase that by switching to fully clavio also an upside is you can see kind of stats like click-through rate and stuff like that you can also see stats within Clavio that you wouldn't see within judge me and also i think it's way dynamic way more dynamically and you can play around with certain stuff that you cannot do within judge me so that's kind of the reason why you want to move to judge me now let's cover actually how to do that so first things first um this is as you see the kind of ugly design what you want to do is you want to click on settings and then what you want to do is you want to click on integrations and then you can just type in Clavio and you see email marketing integration. You can click on Clavio and then this is the API key. You just want to copy paste the API key and actually uh, install it in Clavio. I will not cover this in this video, but I also got another video about installing an API key or like how to actually find your private API key, how to install an API key already on this. Uh, channel so feel free to check that out and um, yeah just install that there um, and then what you want to do is you want to click on send review requests directly via Clavio and send review events to Clavio. and if you enable that it will automatically stop doing anything within judge me so you want to you know enable that and upload kind of all the designs all the emails as soon as possible here what you can also do is Clavio feeds um, uh, I will do another video about how to actually um, upload a dynamic enable review information feed. Um, what this helps you is basically you can, as I said, show reviews within your abundant flows from your products. So that's really, really good. Um, it increases social proof and increases um, click through rate, social proof, basically trust within your potential customer. So that's something that you want to do as well, but I will not cover this in this video. What I will cover is basically the transition from Judge Me to Clavio and also anything that you have to keep in mind while doing that. So as I said, Clavio, Clavio API key, enable that. And what you want to do now is you want to actually um, fulfill a test order. So place an order, use a 100% off this code, place an order, fulfill that, and then just cancel everything. Or if you are not able to do that, you could just wait till the next order gets fulfilled. Because if you do that, um, what you will get is the custom trigger um, that is called when someone eligible for a judgment review request because you need this custom trigger to actually pull this within Clavio. So once you've done the, the, the test fulfillment um, order, you can just see that trigger, set up a flow, um, use this trigger, then you can play around with the dates here, but we said wait 30 days. It's basically after someone place an order, they are eligible for a judgment review request. So now wait 30 days and then we have the first email and then wait 10 days and then have the second email. So now what I wanted to cover in this video as well is how to actually make it dynamic because this is, for example, oh, I already showed you what the email looks like um, within Judge Me. So very, very poorly, um, not dynamically. And what you can actually do is you can have it really, really dynamic, so which actually shows the product that they purchased, the name, uh, review now, basically everything customized. So in this case, we have, hey, Radu, which is the first name here. I hope you're enjoying your needs and wants upward and found the right spot on your vaults. Show the <clears throat> products dynamically. Thanks again for your purchase. It's been a pleasure to provide you with this masterpiece, blah, 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 15% off as an incentive. But how to actually do that? So what you want to do is you want to create a table and then you can play around where, which way, but we basically have the image on the left side. It's dynamically set up. So place dynamic, row collection is event, point product, row alias is product, and then you click on content. The left side is the image. What you want to do is you want to use this code here, product, look up product image URL. 
I will post basically all the um, dynamic variables here, but basically you want to do that. And if you want to, you can also pull the um, image URL dynamically, which um, in that case we decided not to do just because we want people to click on review now and not on the product. So yeah, basically link address is here. Um, and then what we can also do, we can actually do that right now. Um, link address here. So it actually gets to the page as well. Um, and then on the other side, the text, what you want to do is you want to click on product, look up product title, and then this is the same URL that I just saw, saw, showed you. So product lookup review rating URL. So that's basically what you can do. You can also event um, first name, event products, product title. These are all kind of the dynamic um, trees that you can use. Um, it either pulls the, the first name, it pulls the product title, it pulls the product title name, it pulls the product image here with a dynamic um, table or the URL. So basically now what they can do is they can click on here, they can click on here, click here, click here, it's personalized um, and they get to this page. And if they click here, I can also show you that one second. Um, but basically it's way more personalized. It looks better. Um, it increases the sign up rate for reviews. It's basically super, super personalized and really good. So if they click on here, <clears throat> they get to the product page and it automatically pulls them here with the verified email here, name here, and then they can just write the review and then submit it and it's a verified buyer, which is really, really good. So that's kind of what we focus on here. Um, that's the first email, they get this after 30 days and then we have a plain text email after 10 days. Um, again, uh, after 10 days of this email, they get the plain text, which is really, really good as well. So they get like two reminders um, and then if they actually submit the review, as we just agreed on, we have an incentive, they get a 15% off um, uh, incentive. And how to actually get this trigger is tricky as well. So what you want to do is, first of all, for the first one you tested uh, with, or like you had to have a test fulfillment order, what you want to do now is you want to actually submit a review, a test review pretty much. And after that's done, um, you can see here the trigger when someone submitted a review. So you will see that maybe wait five to 10 minutes, but you have to submit a review because then they, they can just see, get the trick. And then basically that's it. You have the uh, email with the review submit, you give the discount code, um, and that's wonderful. So that's kind of what's possible within Clavio and the Judge Me app. And I hope this video in and of itself was of value to you because um, yeah, we figured this out and each app is kind of a little bit different. So you want to make sure that everything's installed properly and everything's working wonderful to increase your review requests uh, and therefore also your reviews for your customers and also social proof, higher CTR, um, higher conversion rate. So everything is way better with more reviews. So I hope this video in and of itself was available to you. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below this video. If you want us to take care of basically everything uh, when it comes to email, SMS, direct mailing, review requests, loyalty programs, referral systems, whatever it is, when it comes to retention systems, feel free to reach out. We're gonna have a chill call. Um, I can give you a free retention audit pretty much uh, going through what we would add, how we would do things and stuff like that. And yeah, let's have a call. I hope this video, as I said, was of value to you. I wish you a wonderful rest of the day and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much. Take care, bye-bye.